Let's go! I got huge things for Bitcoin today, guys. We actually filled one of my orders yesterday. So this is for the 100% profitable trade. So we are going to be talking about that today. We're talking Ethereum, we're talking Chainlink, we're talking Cardano. And hey, if you are a Cardano holder, you will want to watch this video. I've got something huge for Cardano involving Elon Musk. So if you're not aware of what that is, I am going to tell you about that soon. So just stick around. We're also talking about potentially Bitcoin dumping here in the short term. So with that said, guys, thank you so much for getting back and look at this 1,800 subscribers of 100,000. If you still want to be below the 100,000 subscriber count, there's still some time left. Let's see how long this is going to take. But now, now, let's talk about Bitcoin. So yesterday I made a very short update. It wasn't, I mean, it's eight minutes, so it wasn't super short. But I mean, Bitcoin was pushing $60,000 and I said, watch this video before you actually get in. And right now, you know, I talked about this level right here at 55247 and uh, we came down and I've been getting so many messages from people who actually bought here. So that's cool to see. If you got in, you would have been able to make a 2.7% uh, on this trade. But right now you can see that we are getting down again. So I am going to talk about the next support. The next support is actually all the way down at 52,600 Three. So if we break through this level, we are going to see some support here. I'm pretty sure about that. And that brings me to my 100% profitable trade because yes, I did manage to catch this one right here. I did manage to... Uh, also put in orders. You already saw all of my orders over on buy, but I got buy orders all along these uh, orange lines right here. Now, the problem is there is someone potentially trying to hack into my buy bit account, which is you know, a bit weird because you cannot withdraw money anyway. I mean, you, you have to use two fact, you have to use all of these things. But so I don't actually, for security measures, I am not able to access my Bybit account right now. But uh, once I'm able to access that, you already know where all of my buy orders are. You can just look at uh, this right here and you can copy it down. I will uh, post this on Twitter also later today. Remind me if I forget about that. But so far, looking good. And don't panic, guys. Remember, we made a new all-time high yesterday today. So this dump we're seeing right now, yes, I do potentially have some news regarding why we're seeing a dump right now, other than, of course, the traditional markets, because I told you in my video yesterday that the traditional markets were about to open up. And if you start to see, you know, a couple of red candles, then Bitcoin is going to take a hit as well. And you saw a couple of red candles. And so what did Bitcoin do? Of course, it's also going down. So this is why I'm always reminding you guys to keep track of the traditional markets once they open up. They open up at night where I am living. So I'm not able to post this in real time, unfortunately. But... I may be able to try to solve that problem. I'm sure people in the Telegram group were able to point out that the traditional markets were actually opening red. So if you are not yet in my Telegram, make sure to hit this link right here. You can find it in the description of this video. But let's get back to Bitcoin. And I want to talk about one potential reason for Bitcoin going down now other than traditional markets going down. And that is F2 pool. So as you know, F2 pool, there's a lot of FUD regarding these people shorting Bitcoin and then dumping the uh, Bitcoin they have mined. And you can see that we have an outflow right here. This is the outflows from the miner wallet. So if they are transferring their Bitcoin from their wallets to an exchange, that probably means that they are dumping the Bitcoin on that exchange. And so you can see these spikes coinciding with Bitcoin going down. And right now, are you going to see another one of these dumps and see the Bitcoin price go down? Well, that is up to you to decide. I'm just bringing you that information. That is stuff you need to know about right now. Let's quickly move over to Ethereum. You can see that, yeah, we are finding some decent support right here. Congratulations if you managed to catch this week, actually. You were able to make another nice little 3.5% if you managed to get out at the top. I mean, ideally you would, you know, if, you, if you're able to catch this week, you're getting out at this resistance line right here or even this resistance. Perhaps Perhaps, you know, take some profit here and then take some profit here. Now, here's the thing. I'm not talking about the huddle position. And one thing you can expect moving forward, I'm going to be much, much more detailed regarding when I'm talking about my huddle position, 
when I am talking about the short-term trade and when I am talking about something like building a position over time for a 100% profitable trade. So all of that information is going to be much, much clearer moving forward. I'm going to set up a website. So yeah, look forward to that. But other than that, you have the resistance all the way up here at 1,945 is the, uh, is the next level of big resistance. Chainlink, yesterday I did tell you to keep track of this red line right here because if we were were to dump from this level, the orange line at $33, you would probably come down and meet some support along this red line. And yes, we did actually have a huge bounce off of this red line, went up by 4 point, call it 4.4%. 4 now let's move on to the fun stuff. So Cardano, as expected, we are consolidating, whoops, consolidating inside of this vicinity and I, I am expecting uh, this to be pretty strong, especially since we have a kind of two layer of consolidation here. If we break down from this support, then you have the next support very close to it. And if we break through this resistance, you have this resistance close to it. So yes, I am expecting at the very least, if not, uh, you know, consolidation inside of this range, definitely inside of this range for a while. That's what I'm expecting, but let's see how that goes. But for all Cardano holders out there, I need to show you something very, very cool. So here's the thing. This was posted on Twitter by my friend Cass yesterday. So he posted this, look at the Cardano white paper or uh, you know, general uh, information about Cardano. Cardano is a fork in the road, okay? Cardano is a fork in the road. I don't know if that is a general expression in the US. I guess it could translate, you know, you're taking a different path. You can go one path and you can take another, you know. There's probably some symbolism with this expression. Cardano is a fork in the road. But maybe they mean it literally. Maybe they mean that Cardano is a fork, a actual fork in the road. And then you go to Elon Musk and his... Twitter profile picture is a fork in the road. And, you know, I'm not suggesting anything here. I'm not making any claims. I'm not saying anything at all, actually. I'm just bringing you this information because I just thought it was very cool, to be honest. Elon Musk having a profile picture, fork in the road, and a fork in the road in the Cardano white paper. Cool, but I would love to hear your theories down in the comment section. Let me know what you think about this. Is there something to it or is it just a very strange coincidence? Let me know down in the comment section right now. So guys, I am going to keep this short and you can expect a lot of things happening on this channel moving forward. As I said, I'm going to launch a website. I'm going to launch a lot of cool things in the Telegram. I'm going to launch giveaways and a lot of cool stuff. So stay tuned. You want to subscribe right now because apart from bringing bringing you slam dunk trades on a consistent basis and educating you. I'm also giving you all the latest when it comes to altcoins, Bitcoin news, and everything you just need to know to make money in the crypto markets. So make sure to subscribe and let's jump over to one of the coins I am watching like a hawk right now, which is Solana. So Solana, the video is popping up in the middle of this video right now. Just click it and I will see you right there.